Hey team, I've been trying to record this video for almost a month now and have not had time to get it out and I apologize for that. But 2018, that's hard, 210, this many, okay, is upon us and we have some huge changes coming to the channel. Changes for the good, don't click away. I know the word changes scares everyone. We're like, why do you gotta mess up our favorite content? Why do you do that? The lighting looks stupid. Hit thumbs up if you know what that was a reference to. All right, anyway guys, so we have some awesome things coming. Don't worry, your normal Friday content will not be affected at all. It won't, it's gonna stay the same. Fridays will still be your weekly Bible teaching and encouragement. Um, it's just, I have a couple sections, a, a couple uh, videos, I guess a, a little bit more content that I'm gonna be adding on that I think is gonna provide value for your life and it's gonna provide value to this channel. Now I wanna go back over just for a moment, the, the importance and the intention of this channel, just so that I, we're all on the same page, okay? Is that if you notice in the beginning of this video, I referred to you as team. I said, hey team. And I believe that's true. The more I think about it, the more I realize that Christianity isn't a sport against other Christians. Actually, other Christians are our teammates. We are all on the same playing field and we are all fighting for the same victory. Our enemy is not other Christians. Our enemy is the devil who does not want the church to spread, but every other Christian, we are on the same team. We are teammates. Regardless of what church you go to, regardless of your denomination, regardless of your Bible translation or your worship presence, or if you like to play with snakes. I mean, regardless of all that, we are on the same team to make the gospel known throughout the world. So we are a team. And that bold life is gonna recognize that team. Actually, so much so that one of my segments that is coming up is called, that I am loosely referring to it as Our Bold Life. And I'm loosely referring to it because I'm terrible at naming things, so if you have a better name for what I'm about to describe, leave it in the comments down below and we might choose your name over mine, okay? Because it's probably better. I will promise, it's probably better, okay? So what I'm thinking right now for that segment is I've already done a few video interviews with different creators here on YouTube. Uh, different content creators and some of them are Christian channels, some of them are vlogs, some of them are gamers. Um, but I've interviewed uh, Christian creators on what their daily walk with God looks like and what living a bold life looks like to them. And I'm actually be posting one of those up every month. Um, I was planning to do it in the middle of the month, as you can tell it's January and I've missed that mark a little bit. So this first video will be with Trey Van Camp, which he is a vlogger uh, and he is a church planter. Dude is incredible, I had such a great chat with him. I will be posting that up uh, probably in the next couple days, so keep an eye out for that. But each month I'm gonna be posting one video I'm gonna be shooting for around the middle of the month. So each month we will have a segment where I interview some sort of Christian creator, uh, Christian vlogger, Christian YouTuber of some sort, okay? And the second segment I'm adding on is actually gonna be a Tuesday thing that every single Tuesday, starting in February, we're gonna be releasing content I'm calling Two Minute Tuesdays. And basically it's gonna be a short, bite-sized, two-minute devotional where I'm gonna talk about a point, I'm gonna talk about a scripture, I'm gonna talk about a passage, something that's encouraging me this week, you know, but it's gonna be short, it's gonna be two minutes. My idea is that I know some of my videos can get a bit lengthy, I like to talk a little bit too much. So the idea is that I'm gonna be putting out some short, shareable content that you guys can slap that share button that your friends on Facebook or wherever can uh, watch pretty quickly and not take up their entire day, right? So Two Minute Tuesdays are coming, um, Our Bold Life, that, that name is not held, so give me better names down below, and if I choose yours, I will shout you out. Okay, cool? Hold on, I'm gonna get a drink of this. It seems like there was more. Ah, yes! Also, guys, something I am so excited for, I've wanted to do for a while, and I just haven't figured out exactly how to do it, but Good news guys, there is That Bold Life merch is now available over at Redbubble. Um, I will leave a link down below, maybe there's one here if it'll let me do it, I don't even know. But man, I have, I'm so excited because it, it, some of you may know, I'm actually a graphic designer too, that's sort of how I make my side income is with graphic design. So I decided, yes, I will have shirts available with the That Bold Life logo. You can get that on a shirt, you can get it on a phone case, um, you can get it on like pillows, like they do all kinds of stuff. So you can get that almost anywhere. Uh, you can get that logo on almost anything, but also on top of doing just my logo so that 
you can wear the That Bold Life if you want to rep That Bold Life, which would be awesome. I would love that. If you tag in a picture and just use uh, hashtag That Bold Life uh, on Instagram or something, I will probably do some shout outs here on the channel for that. That would be amazing if you would wear that That Bold Life shirt and tag me on Instagram. That would be cool, man. I, I'm excited about that, actually. I hope someone does that. I don't know if anyone will. I just hope someone does, okay? Um, but on top of the That Bold Life merch, I'm also putting out a series of shirts or a series of apparel and, and like I said, it'll be available on phone cases and pillows and jackets and everything. So, but I'm putting out some clothes that I would actually wear. As you, I don't, you might not be able to tell, but I, I actually buy shirts I like. It seems like most people do that. So I'm releasing some kind of, maybe they don't, they don't even say That Bold Life on them, but they're going to be, um, designs and apparel that I think looks good that I would wear. Um, some's gonna be like, you know, long t-shirts and stuff like that, but they're gonna be Christian. They're all gonna have a very clear message of God and most of them will be referencing some of my favorite Bible verses, some that I've probably referenced on this channel several times. Um, actually, here's one right here that's one of the shirts. Um, and actually it's available in men's, women's, um, pillows, phone cases, clocks, everything. Like they, the Red Bubble does everything. Um, but yeah, so this one and this is another design I have out and I have multiple colors So anyway, go check it out I'll have that link down below if you want to pick up some that bold life merch if you do please post a picture and tag Hashtag that bold life. All right, that'd be cool. All right, and finally I've had a few people ask about this um, And I wasn't sure the best time to actually start it, um, but I have started a patreon um, and Patreon is just if you're not familiar. It's how youtubers typically get support like you can, when you reach a certain mark, get support and actually uh, finances from YouTube themselves. Um, but most creators actually get support on Patreon. And what Patreon is, is um, we can go set up a page. I actually have a Patreon page and there are several rewards. If you go check it out, I'll have it linked down below and maybe up here if it'll let me. Um, but if you go to Patreon, you can actually choose to give and there are certain rewards um, for however much you want to give. So if you want to give like $1 a month, you get access to a special Patreon, patrons only feed where I'll post stuff just to Patreon, uh, just to the people who support the channel. And no problem guys, if you, you can't do it, you don't want to do it, no worries. I wasn't even sure I was going to ever start one. Um, I had a few people ask about it, a few people suggest it. So I thought I would. So if you want to support this channel, help me improve, uh, you know, maybe some of my lighting, some of my sound, uh, some of my video, you know, everything that comes in through there will go toward the channel. Um, so if you want to support this channel and support this ministry, support what we're doing here on YouTube, um, head on over to Patreon. I'll have a link um, and you can give whatever you're able. It's completely up to you. If you don't want to, no problem. I completely understand. All right, guys. Anyway, that's some of the updates coming up in 2018. I am excited and I have a goal. All right. I, I wasn't sure actually even through this video if I was going to tell you my goal. Um, because goals are scary, man, especially when you say them publicly because you're like, what if I miss? What if I don't hit? Then, it, then I'm just going to be a failure in the eyes of my whole audience. And I don't want to be a failure in your eyes, but we're a team now, right? We're a team. It's not just me. It's, it's us. We're in this thing together, man. We're out there leading people to live a bold life for Jesus so that people will come to know Jesus and the gospel we know him through out the whole world. So I want to tell you my goal. One of my good buddies, he did this thing that I thought was incredible, man, it's for a Christian channel. He reached 10,000 people in one year. Now I'm starting off with about 300 right now, but I think in 2018, we can reach 10,000 people. I believe that that is my goal. So over the next 12 months, I'm gonna be pumping out content. I'm gonna be going at it hardcore. I wanna reach 10,000 people and I wanna lead 10,000 people in leading and living a bold life for Jesus. Imagine if there were 10,000 more Christians living a bold life for Jesus. What would that look like, man? How would that change your town, your city, your state? How would that change the country and change the world if there were 10,000 more people actively living a bold life for Jesus? That would be incredible. And that is my goal for 2018. Hey, Maybe it won't happen. Maybe I'll get halfway there. You know how I feel about goals. Even if you fail, you are still way better off than before you started, right? All right, guys, love you guys. Thank you so much for being a part of the That Bold Life team. I believe that you are gonna go out and do incredible things, that when you actively pursue and live a bold life for Jesus, that amazing things will happen. So go out, guys, keep living, 
that bold life. Oh yeah, if you enjoyed this video, if what I've talked about has excited you, sounds good, you wanna be a part of that team, go ahead and slap that subscribe button right about here. All right guys, love you guys, keep living that bold life.